So the essential oils history is actually really long and rich, but I'm going to keep it brief. Um, the very first time they were mentioned by name is in the biblical book of Genesis in chapter 37, um, when Joseph was sold to slave traders. He was sold along with different spices like myrrh and balm. Um, and Genesis actually ends with the burial of Joseph's father um, being anointed with myrrh for his burial. And in total, the oils are mentioned either directly or indirectly over 1,100 times in the Bible. Um, and we all know that the Bible is a great historical reference um, that can go back and be um, collaborated with a lot of other historical documents. So we can see that they were used very, very commonly um, during those times. Some of the oldest cultures on earth used essential oils, uh, including the Babylonians. They placed orders for essential oils um, like cedarwood, cypress. The Egyptians actually have the world's oldest recipe for deodorant using essential oils. Um, you might know that they are kind of known for um, being a pretty advanced ancient civilization and deodorant, you guys, with essential oils. Um, Pakistan and Rome, they used essential oils in their bathhouses. That was really common for them. They were definitely even used by Christ. We know the Christmas story um, where he was gifted with the three gifts from the three wise men of frankincense, gold, and myrrh. And frankincense and myrrh are actually essential oils. Um, and there's a reason for that. They are incredibly, incredibly valuable. In fact, in the time, um, frankincense was kind of known as the coconut oil of essential oils with over 10,000 different uses. So it was a very, very rich, very luxurious gift to be given to this teeny tiny baby. They knew that he could always use those. Um, essential, essential oils were also used by the medieval Europeans, uh, many of whom brought back the oils during the Crusades. So that's actually how um, it got into different cultures. It was actually only after World War II when we kind of rediscovered essential oils and it is now kind of just slowly gaining more and more popularity to the point where you probably know either um, at least somebody who is a closet user or somebody who really, really loves and shares their oils. Um, but regardless, they are becoming more and more popular due to their versatility, their ease of use, um, and just their million different ways of, of using them. So 